Hi, it's Dr. Kim Duramo from the American Institute of Mind-Body Medicine, and I want to share with you in this video one of the most powerful ways to transmute energy in your body. One of the main things I teach is that your body has healing power. You have the ability to release old energies causing disease. So even though we might struggle with trying to find a solution or find the right supplement or medication and fix the problem, it's infinitely more powerful to go within, to go within the body and sort of activate this transmutational component, this power that you have where your body can transmute that energy and release it. One of the most toxic energies that we experience is the energy of fear and shame. We're ashamed we have this problem. We're ashamed we haven't done better. We're ashamed maybe there's embarrassment in the past around the body, embarrassment about ourselves, or maybe we even picked it up from people around us. And then the other one is fear. Fear of all of the things I'm feeling, right? So I'm going to not even go there and just get on social media or go out with a friend or, you know, do some kind of behavior that suppresses me from feeling what's happening in my body. So all that fear, it's like when people say the only thing to fear is fear itself. It's our avoidance strategies that create that chaos and turmoil and overrun our adrenal glands and increase our stress hormone, wipe us out, fatigue us, destroy our immune function so we get sick or can't clear a virus easily, destroy our digestive function because of all this fear so we now we can't tolerate any foods and we have to eliminate everything. So... I want to share in this video one of the most powerful ways I found to help you connect in your body, be with the fear, breathe through the fear, and let it release. So I want you to start with, feel, you know, close your eyes and take a deep breath, and just let it go. So relax your shoulders. I'm going to help you meet some of those deeper energies in the body that have been causing the dis-ease, the stress, the turmoil, the illness. So just relax your shoulders and keep your eyes closed. I'll walk you through this. So bring air in, let your belly expand as you breathe, and then let it go. Okay, bring your awareness and your attention into your body. Now I want you to think of something or someone that you love someone that you adore who means so much to you or something or a time in your life when you just felt so at peace and had a sense of joy, ease, and a sense of love. And just let that percolate in your body. Let yourself feel that. Let yourself receive that. Let that expand throughout you. Just this alone creates some chemical changes, some brain changes, and it opens you to receive what we're doing here. So take a few deep breaths with that. Just be present to that. Now I'm going to have you think of something that you don't love, something that you hate, something you can't stand, something that really gets your goat, something you're trying to avoid or change or fix, something that just is a real problem for you. It might be a person. It might be a circumstance. And I want you to think of that, and I want you to breathe into your body. Now the more you bring this to mind, Maybe it's a conversation or maybe it's a certain experience you're seeing and just feel that. Actually, really let yourself, it might be a memory, something that happened a long time ago, a memory with someone. Let yourself really feel that. And now become aware of where do you feel that in your body? It might be like a clenching in your gut, in your stomach. It might be a heaviness on your chest. It might be tension in your neck. It might be a fluttering feeling of fear. Just see if you can feel where you feel this experience in your body, this thing that you don't like, this thing that you're trying to get rid of or change. So keep breathing, keep your eyes closed, relax as best you can, and then become aware of where do you feel this in your body. What you're going to do now is breathe into that area. So even though this upsetting feeling might make you feel like, oh, get me out of here, I have to do something, I want you to go deeper into it. I want you to just relax your body even more fully and I want you to bring all of your breath to that area, to that region. Let this area be what breathes. So if it's a tension in your stomach or a heaviness in your chest, imagine the breath coming right into that area. Let the breath move through this. Be willing to feel all of this energy that's been stored in your body. So take a few deep breaths in there and let it, sometimes it will like turn up the volume on that energy so you feel it even more intensely. It's okay. 
if it's fear actually going into it, bringing the loving attention, the stillness of your breath is what will help it dissolve. So it's not there anymore. It's not running the show and those memories don't get triggered. So breathe slowly into this. And then you can also just put your hand right on your heart. And I want you to tell that space within you, you can repeat after me and just say, I see you in there. And then say, I'm willing to feel this fully. To stop running from this energy. To stop avoiding this experience. And then just breathe fully, relax your body, relax your belly. Now it's the presence of your loving attention that, that allows it, that allows it to be what it is, to move the way it is. All energy wants to move, but it's stuck because it hasn't been able to move. So this presence, this awareness and the breath is what allows that energy to move. It's very, very powerful. So be willing to experience those deep feelings. Let them come up, scary as it may be, and let them resolve. They will actually release using your breath, using your presence. It accelerates the process. So just release the old ways of, of avoiding your fear of, you know, trying to learn more and trying to do more and trying to figure it out or go to the next healer and the next doctor and get the next supplement that's supposed to be the thing. Being present in your body is the most powerful medicine that there is. So this is Dr. Kim Doramo from the American Institute of Mind Body Medicine. Happy to support you with this process. I definitely welcome any comments that you have about this. And I'm happy to support you in any ways that um, I might be able to, to go forward and go deeper in living in full abundance and freedom. When you release this energy, you fill in with love, with light, with the essence of who you are. That's what allows your body to heal. That's your nature. Your nature is health, vitality, freedom, love in all of the things that match that. So sending you my love and support. Make sure you subscribe at drkimd.com for more and definitely share this video with those that you love. See you soon.